Assalamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. In today's video I will show you another easy eye makeup look you can create from the fake Huda Beauty Mercury Retrograde Palette. I will keep it in the pink color story because it looks universally flattering on everyone. The bright shades makes the eyes pop and gives you that fresh faced glow. I will be using the Avon Luxe Velvet Matte Cream Foundations. This particular foundation comes in luxurious glass pot with elegant gold font on the front and a plastic lid also in that pretty and festive gold coloring. It is intended to balance the complexion, mattifying it and leaving a velvet-like finish. It has a mousse cream texture that is enriched with silk, white sapphire extracts and amethyst extracts to help even skin tone and stimulate collagen, also infused with olive oil to help provide skin regenerating properties. I have two shades, Natural Glamour and Porcelain. These have dried out, so to revive it, I will add a drop of the YSL Beauty Oil. Let me show you the swatches. This is Natural Glamour. This has a slightly warmer, peachier undertone. And this is Porcelain. This is the lightest shade with a pinky undertone. Now here are the two shades side by side. The texture without the beauty oil was very grainy, but after adding the beauty oil, it really felt silky soft. The coverage is still very light with a natural matte finish. I will use this classic flat foundation brush. The brush's bristles are flat with a rounded tip. This is perfect for applying creamy foundations. The brush's flat, densely packed bristles allows you to apply and buff in the foundation on the eye with minimal streaks. Just bounce, blend and bluff, I mean buff, your way to seamless finish by using a dry micro mini beauty blender. This is a perfect size for fine detailing with rounded and pointed end to blend away imperfections to blend under the eyes and the hard to reach areas of the eyes. Then I will use this small flat eyeshadow brush. Now the synthetic bristles will not absorb product so the maximum amount of eyeshadow is delivered precisely where the skin needs it most. This brush also has a unique design known as the tri-grip handle to keep your hands steady, comfortable and in control while you do your eye makeup. I will use this brush to dip into the fake Mercury Retrograde palette shade Karma. This is a moderately warm toned medium dark coral with a matte finish. Using the brush I will create a fake crease. Just drag the shade Karma right above the natural crease. This will make the eyes more lifted and open. Slowly apply pressure so the line grows thicker as the brush moves to the outer corner of the eye. Then I will take this shade Utopia. This is a moderately warm toned light medium coral with a matte finish. I will apply this shade slightly on top of the slightly curved arch I just made above my natural crease line. I will use a fluffy brush to gently blend the two shades. Just use soft strokes and make sure the two colors blend evenly. Then I will take this shade Gold Glitch. This is a very warm tone medium gold with a sparkle finish. I will use my finger to apply this in the inner corners of the eyes. Then I will take this shade Galaxy. This is a moderately warm toned medium dark beige with a metallic finish. I will again use my finger to apply this shade in the center of the eyelid. Then I will take this shade Supernova. This is a slightly warm toned light copper with a metallic finish. I will use my finger to press this shade on the outer corner of the eye. Then using the same fluffy brush to melt all the shades together, use an eyelash curler, curl the top lashes and don't forget your bottom lashes. Swipe on a coat or two of mascara. Next I will use a black eye pencil to tight line the upper and lower water lines. And then using an eyebrow pencil, I will use the micro angle tip end to shape, define and add in fine hair like strokes and then complete the brow look by using a spoolie to blend it all. Clean under the eyes. Whatever I did above, I will repeat it for the lower lash line. So here it is the final look. Pink is super versatile and one of the most flattering colors that enhances natural glow, makes eyes pop, works on every skin tone and blends well with other neutrals. You can go soft and subtle or bright and bold depending on the occasion. It's such a cute innocent color but a more pigmented hue reads fierce and assertive. There are a lot of ways to play with this saccharine hue. Create endless looks by just tapping into creativity and experimenting with colored eyeliners for a unique look or stick with the classic black to play it safe. Want all the attention to be on your eyes? Add lashes. And we're done! So I hope one of you really enjoyed watching this video. You know what to do. In case you don't know what to do, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press the bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post. Leave a constructive comment and share this video. I know I know it's a lot to do, but I really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah Hafiz. Bye! Jazakallah khair. Thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here. Check it out.